Hey you guys, welcome back to my channel. I hope everybody's having a great day today. I know that uh, I have never been more agitated in my whole entire life. I don't know what's going on, but I feel like straight up choking somebody every minute, but I got my lip monthly, so my September lip monthly, today is the 21st of October, so I don't know what's going on with, uh, with lip monthly, but I got my September bag. Funny, it wasn't until after I made my YouTube video that they decided to send me my bag. I find that quite interesting. I guess sometimes you have to have a big mouth to get shit done. And I have last month's lip monthly bag here because we're gonna go through it. So, surprise, surprise, I got the new bag, the sassiest bag. It's a bag. Has the Lit Monthly logo back here, over here, and says the sassiest. Sorry, I'm backwards. Not only am I backwards, I have dyslexia too, so it is what it is. Ooh. I got a card. And it says that there will be some of these items inside. I should say too that this is not just the regular Lit Monthly bag. This is the Lit Monthly Plus. It is $19.99 and if you sign up your first bag with first 10, you get your first bag for 10 bucks. The first thing I'm going to pull out is from Jing Ai. And it is Jing Ai Pure Love. No testing on our furry friends. Yeah, sorry, I seen something in my window. Back to this Kabuki brush. It's a mini kabuki brush. Very nice and soft. So. That's the first thing. The second thing is from Lip Patine, and it is a metallic lips metallic lipstick everything is different since from last month I've seen other people unboxings and it was different from last month I like how it's sealed so even it came in a box but it was has a seal on it too so that's uh, that's really nice that's how my hands work so I had to drop it on the on the ground of course now there's cat hair on it This is the luck I've been having. People wonder why I'm so agitated. Try having your hands not work and your brain be dyslexic. Ton of product in there. So. 
Cat hair and all. Who cares, right? I don't care. I really don't care about anything these days. I'm losing that zest for life. A lot of things from Zheng Ai. The next thing is from Cobb. I hope it is the hmm, peach cobbler. I was going to say, I hope it is the, well, peach cobbler could be red because their red velvet was purple. So we'll see. Peach cobbler. Very, very, very beautiful color. Very nice. It's a nice uh, plastic container that it goes into. I like Cobb products. Okay, the next thing is this Kaleido Cosmetics Crazy Foils Eyeshadow. I like that Lip Monthly is putting eye care, eye products, or blushes into this bag. I know a lot of people are bitching about that, but I kind of like it. Makeup's makeup. Two very dark colors. Very nice on your skin though. Very buttery. Let's see. Very nice colors. Called Unicorn Foil. Apparently if you use it wet, the color comes out. I really like those two colors. Those are the two shades. Go big or go home. Cruelty free, no matter what. Unicorn Activated Eyeshadow. Don't really understand the unicorn activation. Could just be that it's a metallic and that's just their their fancy way of being original the next thing is this unicorn snot I know that I think that everybody who subscribes to lip monthly is getting this in their bag this month again it's sealed which we all love sealed products. So takes a minute to open, but it's sealed. Very, very glittery. You can see that coming up. Very glittery. Let's try some of that too. Glitter for the heavens. And then the last thing in the bag is also from Jing Ai. And it is this blusher and it says pure love on it. quite chalky quite chalky and very very little color payoff so my overall thoughts on this bag are I waited a hell of a long time for it and Unfortunately, I do not think that I will be ordering from Lip Monthly again. It's just too much um, bullshit for the products that you get. I didn't get any repeat products from last month. 
so I'm happy with that. But all in all, their customer service is crap. Um, yeah, their customer service is super crap. And when I called them out on Instagram for my bag being over a month late, this is October, this is my September bag, and we're now October the 21st. Uh, yeah, you can say I wasn't too impressed, so I made um, a YouTube video about it, and I said something on Instagram, and the way that they came back with me is not the way that people should treat their customers. They're, I was far from impressed with that, but um, I'll just take it as that. I'm not going to reorder from Lip Monthly. You can try it out for yourself. I got this bag for $10. I got this bag last month for $5, so I think that that is the one good thing. If you can just keep getting their bags at the discounted price, just have to create an email address and then sign up again and get your bags for five or ten dollars then you're not really losing anything but I hope them well in the future I hope that they can get their shit together but right now they're not doing it they're not doing it at all every review I hear is a negative review <clears throat> and the good ones I hear are from the people who have PR so <clears throat> this will be my last bag from lip monthly it's just not worth my time and the the process I've went through to get this bag so I appreciate you guys hanging out with me I do love doing these reviews I wish that I could do them every day but I don't have the funds I'm a single mom who is just barely scraping by so even 10 bucks out of my account is <clears throat> 10 bucks that I could use in different places so those are my thoughts on lip monthly um, again please consider subscribing like the video it really helps me out leave a comment uh, let me know if you receive lip monthly and what your thoughts are on it and I will see you guys in my next video. Love you guys. Bye.